they used to have a toilet for the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Extra chocolate. Oh, look at that. Oh, the Oreos. <laughs> Welcome to America. <laughs> what is up, YouTube? So I am currently chilling in the sauna because it is so cold in Ohio. But I have shoulders today. I'm super excited. And I'm actually going to be doing a workout from bullmarkfitness.com, which is our membership-based website. There's a free trial on there if you want to check out our website. Um, if you're interested in workout plans, custom nutrition, the whole nine yards, definitely check that out. But Today's workout is a 500 superset, and you can see here all of the exercises are listed with the reps, a few notes, and if you don't know how to do an exercise, there's a little drop down that pops up with a video on how to do each exercise. There's also, if you can see that little orange arrow, there's a swap feature. So say you don't have a band, or if you don't want to do a band that day, that's totally fine. You just hit the swap, and it swaps it for you. Or you can swap it back. It's super fun. So I'm going to kill this. You guys will see it. So just so you can see the workout again. It's 100 dumbbell lateral raises, 100 band upright rows, 100 crawl ups, 100 seated shoulder bombs, and 100 band rear delt pull aparts. Or again, if you want to do something different, you can swap it with the rear delt cable flies. Then I'm going to hit up cardio. Then we're done. But. Today's been a really good day already. We dropped off our friend Rion at the airport. He went back to South Africa today, which is why we've kind of taken a little YouTube hiatus. He was with us for about a week. And before we dropped him off, we went to Duck Donuts, you guys. Our Bomar Fitness leggings, what I'm rocking today. These should be available on pre-sale very soon, within the next week or so. So definitely check out Something now, know something now I didn't before And all I've seen Since 18 hours ago Screen eyes, freckles in your smile In the back of my mind Making me feel like I just wanna know You better know You better know You better know I just wanna know You better know You better know You better now I just wanna know Alright, 
so we are home from the gym and I am making a venison tater tot casserole. It's really good, um, makes a lot, so if you have kids, hungry husband, you just want to meal prep. So I'll show you the macros on this in a few clips. It's actually pretty delicious and pretty healthy and extremely easy. So it's not complicated, it's got good macros, and it tastes really delicious. So you're just going to brown two pounds of meat, and then you're going to use two cans of peas, and then two cans of cream of mushroom soup. Cook it for about 30 minutes at 350. I'm gonna put ours on our Traeger. I unfortunately can't show you the Traeger because they're coming out with a new one and we already have it, but it's not launching for another week. So you can do this in the oven or if you do have a Traeger, you can do it on that as well. So you guys will see it all happening. Browning my meat right now. So this is again, two pounds of venison. You can do two pounds of turkey or lean beef or whatever you want, but what we use in the Bomar household. So I kind of accidentally forgot to show you guys the finished product before I started eating, but I just wanted to show you the food. The macros will appear right here like magic. And there you have it. The recipe will also be in the caption Ooh. below. So ever since the Arnold, a bunch of people, wowza, um, have been asking me what tanner I use. Josh and I canceled our tanning bed membership in like, like 2014, 2015, I don't know. It's just so bad to tan. Unless you're going on a trip where you know you're gonna get actual sun, you should not be in a tanning bed. Really bad for your skin, premature aging, skin cancer, the whole nine yards. So for us, as you all know, um, being tan does make you look leaner and more cut up and creates better shadows on your body. As meathead as it sounds, it's true. And I don't want to look like I'm 90 when I'm only 28. So we do use self tanner. We like being customers before we like being affiliates or ambassadors or sponsored athletes of a company. So we will be paying clients before we ever reach out to a company to work with them just because that's that's our moral standard, that's our moral code. And I then feel good about promoting the product because I know I've already bought it and I believe in it and I trust in it. So. Ever since the Arnold, a bunch of people have been asking us what sort of tanner we were using, what was on our bodies, as obviously we live in Ohio, it's like 40 degrees, and we clearly weren't outside laying out. So I want to show you guys that. Um, we do have a coupon code where you can get 15% off. The code is Bomar Fitness. You get 15% off. Everyone's happy because everyone is tan, cut up, diced up at the gym. Feeling good, looking good. I feel a million times better when I'm not freaking Casper. So this is the company. All right, so here's the company. It's called Rosa Self Tanning and they have two different colors that I like. I'm like tropical. There's a competition tan as well if you are going, um, if you are competing. And then I like everyday color for the youth as well. For the Arnold, for example, the two nights before, I did one coat of this. In the morning, I showered, washed the top coat off, and then one night before, obviously the night before the Arnold, I did this, one coat of the topical, and then just kept it on. And then throughout the weekend, each night, I just put on a coat of the youth. So that was my like mm, expo color. For normal, like everyday stuff, I will just do a coat of the youth, like at night, two to three times a week at most. Obviously we are at the gym sweating quite a bit, so you might not even have to apply that regularly. Just put on a rubber glove and squirt it on yourself, spray it on yourself, and then rub it in. It's just like lotion of it, it tears. It, blends really well. I've used other stuff in the past where you had to use a paintbrush or a roller or anything like that. You do not have to do that with this color, which is really nice. So 
Why, Jerry? Do you want to be tan? You're a white kitty. You're a white kitty. Anyways, super easy. Just wanted to give you guys that. Also, in the midst of all of this, me filming and everything else, Josh and I have officially decided to come to the Chicago Fit Expo. We're gonna have a Bomar Fitness booth there. We, God willing, will have apparel. We will definitely have Bomar bands. We will definitely have natural science products. And we will also have Rugged Meats snack sticks at the booth. That is May 6th and 7th. So definitely if you live in the Chicago area or you want to come see us, we would absolutely love that. We will obviously be there open to close, probably past closes. That kind of usually is how it works. It will be our own booth. We're really excited. It'll be our first time actually having a booth by ourselves. So I think this is a really good trial run, especially because we want to have our own booth at the Arnold next year. So that is also in the works. Hi, Tom. Oh, Thomas. He's the best. Tom and I just celebrated. Your eyes watering. Tom and I just celebrated our five year adoptive virtue. Didn't we? Yes, we did. So if you can adopt, if you want to rescue, you could have one of these. Or one of these. But we found Jerry. If you didn't know. I think I need to do like a Tom and Jerry story. Because I don't feel like a lot of people. Like a lot of new people have started following me. Since we found Jerry on the side of the road. And since I obviously adopted Tom five years ago. Before I even had Instagram. Which is pretty cool. So that's Tom. He's the bigger one. Hi Tom. And this is Jerry. She's the small one. Like I said, they are rescued. They are like two and a half, three years apart. I found Tom in Toledo at a Humane Society and I found Jerry, we found Jerry on the side of the road in Cincinnati, literally on the side of the road. Like she was, she would have been squished that night. There's no doubt. You'd have been squished. So squished. So squished. So luckily we did find her. That might be a fun YouTube video to make. I don't know, maybe. If you guys would like to hear the Tom and Jerry story, definitely. I also realized that I suck at filming like vlog closing videos. I don't know, whatever. Um, so I'm gonna eat an apple with peanut butter. <laughs> Whoa. And obviously I don't show you guys like, when I like show you guys the food I'm eating, unless I'm doing like a full day of eating, like I eat a lot more than what I'm showing you. So don't be like, oh my God, Sarah Bomar only had two donuts and some tater tot cats roll and an apple today. That's what I'm gonna eat. No, I eat a lot more stuff. I just don't film me drinking protein shakes and eating like boring food. So unless I'm doing a full day of eating vlog, I'm eating more than what I'm showing you guys. So just a little whatever disclaimer, whatever thing on there. Cause I know how the internet works. So I'm gonna eat, do some emails, do some errands, cardio, edit this, and then print taxes off, because that sounds really fun. I'm so not excited to do that. I'd literally rather do anything else, but it is what it is. I'm an adult, I have to do it. So, see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Unless I film my super cool and innovative apple cutting thing. I mean, do you guys really need to see how I cut? and eat an apple. Whatever, I'll do it, whatever, I'll do it. Okay. Wow, Sarah, such content. There's peanut butter and there's an apple. Wow, cool. Okay, I'm gonna eat, bye, I love you.